you, Mr. Chairman, and for some reason this microphone is uh, goes limp all the time. Maybe uh, we can uh, uh, get it to maybe with some uh, Viagra or something. We can get it to get it to. Us. I hope nobody chooses to take your words down, Mr. Johnson. Hey, Johnson. The Honorable James Overstar from the great state of Minnesota. Sometimes I think that state has a, uh, uh, a political, uh, psychological conflict. I really call that not many depressive, but something, you psychotic, maybe. Now, when we debate the wisdom of sending more than 20,000 young men and women into battle in this so-called surge, we are expected to trust an administration which has been so consistently wrong. And it is difficult to remember that we are in Iraq uh, fighting for a war whose justification has not been uh, uh, justified at all. If lying about consensual sexual activity fits the bill for impeachment, then certainly lying to the American people about the reason for invading Iraq, a sovereign nation, certainly that qualifies as an official, uh, excuse me, as an, Im uh, an impeachable offense. So many people have lost confidence in, in government and government's ability to provide for the people. Uh, they call it socialism or big government, whatever it might be. But I'll tell you, when it comes down to things like education and health care, I don't think any other sector of society can do it better than the government. With all of these unlimited dollars flowing through, we'll see more Republicans getting elected, uh, both local, state, and federal. That's what will happen if we don't pass the Disclose Act. Well, I guess we'll probably have uh, folks uh, putting on uh, white hoods and white uniforms again, and uh, riding through the countryside, intimidating people. And, um, you know, that, that's the uh, logical conclusion if uh, this kind of um, attitude uh, uh, is not uh, rebuked. Hey, Johnson. It, it, it's important that this nation produce a competitive worker who is well educated, well trained, and healthy, and and also someone who uh, has uh, good uh, uh, clothing and, and housing, air that we breathe, and uh, so so food, shelter, clothing, those things are basic. Healthcare, education comes right thereafter. And do we want to turn that over? Do we want to outsource that uh, to uh, the private sector, to the private sector whose only, or whose main uh, concern is profit? Uh, this troop surge is wrong. Two wrongs don't make a right. Thank you. I'll yield back. I don't know how many square miles that, that is. Do you happen to know? I don't have that uh, figure with me, sir. I can certainly supply it to you if you'd like. Yeah, my, my fear is that uh, the whole island will uh, become so overly populated that it will tip over and, uh, and capsize. <laughs> by sidestepping the um, 
the uh, civil process, you know, at the courthouse, in other words. And when you, you know, I, I got this vision in my mind of the courthouse on the square, and there's a, like a, uh, you can go around the courthouse in a circle, and then there's all these uh, restaurants with great breakfasts and uh, great lunches. And uh, you can be there all day, and I'm thinking about a, a, a hot summer day with the fan just uh, kind of twirling around lazily. It's a lazy afternoon, and um, nothing else to do. I've hung out uh, on the porch since early morning, did a little fishing uh, after that. Uh, Played some checkers thereafter. Got something to eat at lunchtime, and and now I heard about this great lawyer that's trying this case over here in the courthouse. So I go over there, uh, and you spend your afternoons uh, uh, watching uh, the lawyers. And, um, and at that same courthouse, you can, if you want to know whether or not you're your uh, neighbor has beaten his wife. How many times that he has beat his wife? You can go to the courthouse and find that. Uh, if you were to cut people open to dissect them, after you looked at them, you would see that they got eyes, ears, nose, mouth, teeth, legs, Two legs, two arms. Uh, they have, uh, you go inside, I'm not going to talk about what else I could see from the outside, but you, you go inside, everybody's got a brain, uh, you know, thyroid or heart that hurts when you get discriminated against. Uh, everybody's got, uh, you know, an intestinal system, respiratory system. We're all the same people. It's awesome.